The only thing in this world that I care about is animals. Once you get to know them all, your life and your beliefs may all change. Do you believe that? Hmm? It was four years ago, while trying to save a little girl in a flood, that he drowned. He's the only one here that didn't die in this hospital. Hey, you know what? Last week I opened a Weibo account. For seven, he's got a few thousand followers. Look, <laughs> he's really popular. So what? It's got nothing to do with you. You're so wrong. At least a third of them will become my fans. Why wouldn't they love me as well? <sighs> because Seven is lovable. But you? Stop dreaming. All right then. <laughs> I don't care about others. I only care about one person. Really? And who's that? You know my heart and how I feel in every way I will always try to be the best again There's a chance you'll find me for the harmony Trying hard to find a way to make it right So be with me, my darling I can't live the day without you. So I'm here, would you please? Don't ever go away. Sooner or later, you'll be leaving for your dream, won't you? Plasma cells are white blood cells. Plasma cells. Oh, hey. Hey. B L A D E. B L A D E. Blade. L A E B I S L A E B I S Davis Davis. <laughs> What's your problem, buddy? You scared me. Can't you see I'm busy preparing for the exam? <sighs> I know. You're still grieving over Pilot's death. <sighs> but it couldn't be helped. He died from old age. That's the best way to die. I was a good dog. And was lucky, too. He spent his whole life with somebody he really liked. That's great. In fact, it's my dream to die peacefully when my time comes. Did Pilot's death remind you of Mimi and Ada? I miss them, too. But things like life and death are hard to understand. Even I haven't straightened it out yet. It's just fate. Don't dwell on it. I... Why am I comforting you? I should be worrying about the exam. It's nice being a dog, right? You don't have to make choices. Just find a nice owner and then live a comfortable life. What about me? Should I study for the VET credential exam, or should I prepare for the GRE? Uh, how am I going to choose, buddy? Uh, hmm. Hey, 
Seven. A verified account followed you. <laughs> You're becoming like a celebrity, boy. Tell you what, when we get famous, we'll have more fans than this guy. Let me write something for today. Just now, a wise man told me something about life. <laughs> Set. Little, dear little apple, I can never love you enough. Oh. <sighs> Just look at you, Seven. You're not of any help here. If you lend me a hand and help me finish quicker, Daisy's like to give me a pay rise. Then I can buy you some snacks. <sighs> Don't get too close to Knock me. Knock it off. I've got some info. What a hero. All you ever have to share is gossip and nothing else. <gasps> really? What do we do? It's simple. Take Lola and Seven to the amusement park. Lola's always hanging around. I don't have time to take her out. That's it? Deal. <gasps> You know what? <laughs> so funny. Hey, Dad. <laughs> Who is this? Good looking Eva. You know what I mean. What do you mean? You know. Uh, just stop playing dumb, okay? <sighs> Enough of this. Back to work with you. If you can't make any money, you're out of here. No, 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 no. I'll get back to work. Next time, don't take your jealousy out on me. You... <gasps> You jerk! <laughs> You're my little, dear little apple. Ridiculous. He says I'm jealous? Why would I get jealous? So what if he likes Eva? I don't care. Why didn't you knock? It was open, so I let myself in. What? Who are you jealous of? What is it? You got something to tell me? I'm busy. Of course I have. Mm. <gasps> Ever since I set the dress code requirements for you, your style has reached a completely new level. But I think you can't just focus on your appearance. You also have to cultivate your inner light. What exactly do you want? Um... <laughs> Don't you think? Lola's a poor little girl in need of our care. She's a poor kid. And don't you find her quite adorable? Of course. That's right! Lola is such a poor but adorable little girl. How can we just keep her confined in this pet hospital with the dogs and cats every day? Don't you think that deep down she's lonely and unhappy and desires company? You make a good point. And as friends and workmates of her mom, shouldn't we do what we can to help her create some wonderful memories? What is it that you're getting at? Let's take her to the amusement park. Y you and I? Right! I need a break or I'm going to collapse! We have more than a hundred animals in this hospital. I have to monitor what they all eat. I work from morning till dusk. You know how much work I do now. As director, you should consider the feelings of your subordinates and give me a day off to unwind. Why don't you ask Eva to go with you? Well, she can't take a day off. Truth is, 
This hospital can function without you, but it can't without Eva. There are too many trivialities that she has to deal with. Hmm? All right. For the sake of Lola... Fine. Let's go. <laughs> Wait up. Hey. Wait up. Excuse me. May I ask if this is the beauty salon? Yeah. Come on in, miss. Sorry. Ma'am, see for yourself. I'm afraid I'm not a miss. I'm a mister. Oh my. <laughs> and I'm not a ma'am. I'm a sir. Sir, your skin looks great. Few guys have skin as delicate as yours. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm flattered. Yours is even better. Hey, you know how they describe it? Flawless and radiant. <laughs> is my skin really that good? <laughs> um, look. I want to get my darling a new hairstyle. I want something very, very unique. You know what I mean? Something that is one of a kind. It stands out from the rest. Got it? Ah, yeah. Um, similar to you. <laughs> uh, uh, right. <laughs> no problem. No problem. <laughs> well, do you have any specific requirements? Um, uh, specific? All right, now look at me. Look at me. Classy, neutral, fashion forward with a side of whimsy, right? You know, um, well, I put it this way. Listen, fashionable, but you know, nothing too edgy. That's how I define my style. What's more, I hate being ordinary. You know what I mean? Another thing, um, better at a touch of softness, you know? But not too soft, you know. In brief, give him a hairstyle that goes well with oh, my yeah, style. Oh, I got it, got it, got it. I'll make him look just like you. Exactly. <laughs> uh, may I ask you something? Are you a Virgo? Is that how you hit on girls? I'm not a Virgo. I'm a virgin. I'm only asking about your sign. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm a Gemini. My ascendant is virgin. No wonder. Uh, no, I mean Virgo. Dun, 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 dun. <sighs> what do you think? Oh dear. Uh, that, that's not what I want, you know? Really? Wait a sec. Done! Look, how about now? You know, this is a bit... This is a bit too much. How will you want? Not really. I'll try again. Okay, I believe in you. You must like this one. Hey, I've given it my all and you're still not satisfied? Look, what I want is simple. I've explained already. You know, trendy, but not over the top. Simple and neutral, but can't be boring. Soft, but not too soft. So enough! Shut up! What the hell do you want? Are you torturing me or the dog? Uh, 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 take it easy. 
Don't get worked up. It's not good for your health. Uh, how relax. Can, how can relax. I relax? It's been two hours. Uh, oh, it's okay. My darling doesn't mind staying a bit longer. You know what I think? The first hairstyle you made for her was pretty good. How about... How about we go with the first one? Are you... Are you messing with me? No, no, no. <laughs> Calm down. Why would I do that? <sighs> are your hands all right? The first one. Finished. That's what I want. That's it. Gorgeous. I love it. But hey, don't get me bothered. If you say one more thing, I'll have a heart attack, a workplace injury. Well then, I'll take you to the hospital. Um, from now on, I'll only come to you to style my darling's hair. Please, I beg you not to come back. Fine, it's fine. We won't be back till next week. <laughs> All right, I've got things to do. I'm off. What's this? Uh, let me, let me. Okay. This leash is pretty cool. I'll take one next time I come, okay? Then, we should get going. Okay. Thanks a lot. Go get a massage. Bye. Oh, right. You know what? You're a good man. I mean it. You're great. <laughs> I'll get you something to eat instead, okay? No way! I want to ride that one. Well, <laughs> listen to me. That one isn't any fun. Lola, just imagine a big guy like him yelling and screaming like a baby on a roller coaster. Is that scary? Yes! It's okay, girl. Don't be scared. So let's not ride it, all right? Let's play with Seven, okay? Go on ahead. Come on, play with seven. Seven. <laughs> you know, it's so touching to see children playing with dogs. Right. Kids are innocent, simple, and adorable. <sighs> Why must we grow up? Right. Why do we have to grow up? Growing up only brings us pain. Mm. What are you doing here? <laughs> Seven, are you watching him for Mama? Hmm? You mean Ada? <laughs> Lola, take Seven for a walk, okay? Go ahead, head out, Seven. Go on. Ask you something? What is it? What's your favorite color? Why are you asking? It's a mental test. Both black and white. White? That's way too bland. Are there any others? Mm, red. Red? Mm. Oh, okay. Then, what kind of clothes do you like to wear? Why are you asking? I'm just asking. Just asking. <laughs> Someone's calling. <laughs> Hello? Oh, Hogan. 
What? You're in the hospital? Whoa, whoa, really? Okay, I'll be right there, right there. Yeah, 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 I'm on my way. Hold on. E what is it? Something happened. What? What's wrong? I have this friend named Hogan. He hit his head, and it sounds serious. I need to get to the hospital. Is he all right? You stay here with Lola and Seven, all right? When you're done, head back. Okay. Oh, right. Remember to give me a call when you leave, okay? Okay, then. Careful on the road. Yeah, yeah. <sighs> See you. Mm, bye. Rez! <laughs> Welcome to our shop, sir. Anything I can do for you? Oh, I'm just looking around, looking around. Who are you buying clothes for? Uh, for a friend. Is it your girlfriend? <laughs> kind of. here. It's a top seller in our shop. It's a bit too garish. You prefer something simple? Yeah. How about this dress? It's all black. You don't like the color? No. Why don't you tell me her measurements, figure, skin tone, and style? That'll help us find something. Mm, she's about this tall, this tall, and, and she's very slim and curvy. Her skin color is pale, but in a healthy way, you know? It's radiant and glowing, kind of white. She looks... What isn't the word for her? She's gorgeous. She's elegant, classy, and out of this world. <laughs> Does that make sense? Hmm. She must be beautiful. <laughs> this dress might look good on her. Eh? This one looks great. But she's not into dresses or skirts. Believe me, every woman appreciates a nice dress. Especially one coming from a man who appreciates her beauty as much as you do. I'm certain she'll like it. Okay, I'll take it then. <laughs> oh, okay, I'll pay my Wait a second. <sighs> Sir, please sign here. All right. Okay. Thanks. Hello? Hey, Eva. Yeah, yeah, I'm in the shopping mall. I'll be right back. Could you buy me ten more minutes? Yeah, yeah, ten minutes. All right, all right. Thanks. Bye-bye. Ready? Just a minute, okay. hold on. Be good, boy. Stay still, oh, come on, be good. Whoa, 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 be good, be good. Hey, hey, stay still. What are you doing, Johnson? Come with me. Oh, coming, coming, coming. Wait a sec, honey. Come. Well, uh, hold on. Let me get the seat ready for you. Just for you. Okay. Good girl. Lola, did you have fun? Hmm? Are you happy? <laughs> That's great. We're going. Sit tight. back. How's your friend? No need. Lola's tired. It's getting late. Alright, see you later, okay? 
Why should I drive slowly? <sighs> You're such a nag. Mm, all right, see you. Mm. Seven. Who turned off the lights? Where is everyone? seriously and honestly speaking I just look down on the work but after working here I've grown fond of it and all of you I really enjoy what I do here and I've learned what love is this hospital is full of love you guys have changed me a lot and taught me all about life one person I must thank is our boss Daisy She's doing a great job in spreading love and care. She's like an angel. Our boss is so busy with work, she's forgotten her own birthday. So today I'm here to give her a surprise. I hope she'll stay pretty and give more love to this world and to us. Happy birthday, Bob! Happy birthday, Bob! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! Guys, it's a special birthday. I mean it. Come on, let's drink. Let's drink. Let's drink. Yeah, let's go. Let's drink. drink. Let's drink. Cheers. 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 Here. This is a birthday gift for you. See if you like it. Thanks. <laughs> um, believe it or not, I'm I'm not a big fan of dresses. Uh, uh seriously? <laughs> yeah, you've got a wonderful figure and a pair of long legs. Even the dress will be sad if you don't wear it. Stop kidding around. Thank you, nevertheless. Thank you. So, you don't celebrate your birthday? I'm not a birthday person. Thanks, I'll put it away. Possible. Why didn't you plan all this? And how did I not know? <laughs> this was supposed to be a surprise. He doesn't seem so upbeat these days. So we want to do this 
to cheer you up and encourage you. Mm. I've been pretty depressed lately. Time to look ahead. Right. What kind of future do you want? What kind of future? I don't really know. I just want to continue being myself. The future should be an extension of now. Maybe we're in the future now. And you? Me? Mm. My future is my dream. I'll do everything I can to achieve it. Hello. Hello, sir. This is uh, Luke. We uh, talked before. Uh, I've got my tuition fee ready. Should I send it to you or... Uh, oh, I got it. I understand. Okay. Fine. Fine. I got it. Thank you. Thanks. Uh, how could they raise the service charge again? That doesn't make sense. I... Seven? You came here alone? You want some water? What's troubling you, boy? Based on the x-ray, it looks complicated. He's suffering from liver damage, needs an operation. Flynn, get ready for it. Okay. Ming Ming, get him to the operation room. Right. Leah, get the tools okay. ready. Wait, boss. Hmm? <laughs> well, remember the dress I bought you? Why didn't you wear it? The color's too loud. It's not my style. How can it be loud? How can I not be your style? You look great in it. What do you know about me? Fine. Whatever you say is right. Hey, something else. Look at... How many followers I have? They just keep coming and coming. I bet in a short while, I'll become an internet celeb. Look, look who's following me. The most popular dog blogger, Coco. Do you see how popular I am? <laughs> Get over yourself. She's interested in Seven, not in you. Just relax. <laughs> That's me. Never underestimate an aspiring young man. One day, when I become famous, you'll regret it. Oh, it is really fast. I placed the order yesterday. Should I sign here? Hey, Johnson, what did you buy this time? Let me see. Hey. Come on. Look at this. God. Give me, give me. Hey, back. hold on. Han Hu, 
Wow, you bought their products again? Why don't you just do commercials for them? Oh, geez, you're so annoying. I can't use skincare products. Do you have an issue with that? Ridiculous. What's uh... with you, Ming Ming? You bastards. Oh my. Coco, you must have heard about the recent stray dog trafficking. This is unforgivable. We should work together to help those poor things. Dad, what's up? Blind date? I don't think that's necessary. It, it really isn't my thing. I know, I understand, but I'm already seeing somebody right now. How do you know it's not true? I'll take her to see you sometime. Fine, 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 fine. Time's turning. When can you stop pushing me? Jesus. First nagging about my job, now about my relationship? Hey. Coco, you're head of an animal welfare association. You can't just sit and watch. You've got many followers. I'm sure they're all willing to help. Jeff, Arthur, I know we can't sit back and do nothing, but we can't rush in either. We have to form a team and work out a detailed plan. Daisy, just tell us what to do. That's right, Daisy. So what do we do? We're going to make use of all the media we can to get people's attention. As for a specific work plan, I'll send you both messages when it's ready, okay? I want you to track down those dog traffickers and keep me updated so I can alter the plan if necessary. Okay. All right. There's a blogger named Seven who's concerned, too. Should we consider getting him on our team to help with the operation? Don't bother with that. He'll find a way in if he really wants to. Okay. We'll get him in then. Mm. Be careful out there. You too, Daisy. Mm. <laughs> Hello. Delivery. Must be the snacks I bought for seven online. Eva, don't you think people have gotten really indifferent? Two faced internet celebrities are the worst of all. At the end of the day, all they care about is the fame. They don't even care about dogs. Really? Not all of them. I know there's a famous dog blogger named Coco who has done a lot to help improve animal welfare. <laughs> That's exactly who I'm talking about. You've heard about the stray dogs? I sent her a message. And she still hasn't responded. She hasn't? But that's so irresponsible. Right? If I knew who she was, I'd let her have it. Hi, sir. Can I help you? What's wrong with your turtle? He's been curled up in his shell for quite a while. Completely still. He won't even come out to eat. So I, I'm a bit worried. What's wrong with him? could it be? He's been in there for days. It's not time to hibernate. Yeah, what do we do? This is a very rare case. Let me think about it. I'm not sure what's going on. Once there was a mathematician 
he wanted to get the volume of a bulb. He measured all the parameters and tried to work out a formula. Later, a physicist dropped by. He simply put in a measuring glass of water and figured it out. Is that sarcasm? So, what do you want to do? <sighs> hey, what are you doing? Now what? Stop! Are you trying to make roast turtle? The simplest method is always the most effective. All right, get out. You're giving me a headache. I've got it. I'm pretty sure I know what it is. Look, on a shell, there are multiple white spots. And it smells bad, right? Not eating or moving. Looks like the typical symptoms of shell rot. Is it curable? Do I look like someone that can't cure it? Look at this, Seven. As the saying goes, comparisons are odious. That's so true, right? Just look at you. Good food, comfy bed, and everything. You're so lucky. Look at them. They're miserable. Hey. <sighs> What? This blocker. There's no way it's Eva. It can't be Flynn. Could it be Daisy? Hey, where are you going? Thank you.